WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This year, 1 p.m. update, and currently we have a little bit of a mixed bag out here. You've got the Dow trading higher by 32 points, and NASDAQ Composite is higher by 7. The other indices are trading to the downside. The Dow is off a half a percent. That equals about 191 points. The S&P, two-tenths, or 10 points. The Russell 2000 is off 1%, 20 points. The semis are off 1.5%, 55 points to the downside. You got gold trading out at 1938. That's off 15 bucks. Silver's down 39 cents, 1.5%, or printed out at 2522. Lights we grew to, lights we crewed off nearly uh, 6%, or $6.80 right now. 107.09 is its print. And natural gas is off six pennies, trading out at 554. Let's go spend a little time with our nine panel market update chart. We begin by looking at the ES mini upper left hand side. Now, what's not shown here? is that today will form bar number nine of a TD9 count so long as price closes above 40... Da, 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 da. I believe it's going to be this bar right... Uh, da, da. I should have told you the bar. I'd be right back here. Yeah, so as long as the ES Mini closes above 45.14.75... No, it's really the close. 45.05 today. As long as price closes above that, and you're going to get bar number nine of a TD9 count. Now, you've got spot volatility explodes, 50-day exponential moving average. That's always bullish to a certain extent for the S&P 500. But when we've got a top in place, that may not be the case. The NQ is also going to form, or it appears that it will form, a TD9 count top. Now, we know about these tops that they can form a bars eight. Well, that would have been Friday. Today, bar nine, or could occur tomorrow. So we should see some type of top, maybe just a short-term top with price pulling back to their oscillator and change lines. That would still be a decent move inside the East Mini. That would be a move back to about the 44.05-ish area. U.S. dollar index is showing some strength. It is trading above a descending trend line, but really just consolidating with inside its daily profile. So between 98.29 and 99.47. Gold testing the bullish structured daily profile so nothing broken there in its pullback the same thing with silver getting all the way down to the bottom of its daily profile at the 2497 level so nothing broken there just price testing support lightsweet crude is attempting to form a, a, a brand new daily profile and if we do get this profile and we get a close below 107.35 or 107.29 that would suggest lower price Natural gas, I believe it negated its TD9 count, is my recollection. That says it wants higher price, but we'll confirm that during the Trader's Edge shows. Folks, if you're out to start your day, have a magnificent one. Otherwise, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show. We'll be back in just a few.